whole thing and realize that we are all part and parcel of each other in Nigeria. The Yoruba, the North, yeah. Uh, yeah, the, all the old ramifications came in, and I had to ask for clarification mm. where, where I had doubt, mm. you know, and that was what happened to me. Deni Giadele was a trader oh. in Kano City mm. in the North. Mm. So he found out, and then they brought Deni Giadele. Actually, Adeni Giadele was like when I had my birthday. <laughs> The day when I had my birthday, <laughs> he came. They came. He came down. They said, "I uh, all wanted to see him and things like that." Just he was going to meet him. A in casual Lagos. invitation. A, a casual invitation. Hmm. But as soon as he landed at Ido, the drones were already prepared. <laughs> my grandfather was still saying that he could not ascertain where he came from, hmm. because when he came in, and my fa my grandfather banned him. Hmm. Not never to campaign at the Salegongo Square. That's a whole lot. A whole lot. Ban a whole lot. Never to campaign. campaign. And if he, if he dare him, he would see what happened. <laughs> and a whole lot, they never did it. It was uh, then uh, Mustafa Abdullah Hiraji decided that he's going to avenge that because of the of the of the uh, uh, the, the Christian the, the, the introduced the uh, Islamic religion religion hmm. into the Yoruba land. Hmm. Reintroduce it, and that was how my 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 grand my great grandfather came in, and then they they came in to force a whole lot with the forces of Igalas and uh, the Tapas, you know. Yes, sir. Later they came in with them, and then they, they then they become you either choose the Quran hmm. or sword. You either choose the Quran, Quran or, or the sword. sword, and that was how uh, they became. Imale, Imalile, okay. when the body Thomas came back to Oyo and they started to ask uh, of the Allah, of it, yeah. who are you not to accept? This is the new leader of Yoruba. Yoruba and Allah of it said, but they, how you, you are shouting in, uh, in the palace. And you are Balogun Oyo. Okay, he has a traditional yeah, title. The title that oh, they yes, gave from Oyo. Yes, it's from yeah, Oyo. You are from Oyo. Yes, we I, don't. You know, we don't do this. This this man has influenced you wrongly, and then when he kept it on, they are, wait, I'm coming, and then went into the room and came back. Now that you have, you, you have already established yourself that you are no longer a, a respecter of the uh, tradition, just the way you are shouting on me, continue to bark mm. as a dog all over throughout your life. And that was how he came back, and then he became the, uh, the talk of the town. <laughs>
Well, it's another very lovely, wonderful day in Nigeria, West Africa. Today, Tuesday, 29th of August, year 2023, as we meet an icon and a man of impeccable achievement, a man of impeccable character, a man who is not just a medicine man, but a thinker, a philosopher king, a doer, an author, a writer, a man who has seen it all, and a man you can call the chief of the old block. He was there when Nigeria started many years ago, the good days of the olden day Nigeria. He saw it, the political activities and activism of those days, and by the special grace of God, four, five, six, seven decades down the line, he's still around. And because the Yoruba people of the western part of Nigeria says, Agbakiwa, Loja, Koryo Motuzuko Wo. And that is the reason why we have laid an ambush for him when he came into this country from the United States of America for his 80th birthday, which took place on Saturday, August 26th. It was a special event, something that he was not even planning for, but it's something his family, his fans, his well-wishers and people who are, he has mentored planned for him and we said because of this good opportunity let's chance on him to hear about the past of Nigeria and how we could build a new Nigeria, rejuvenate an old country, bring out the new good things that we need to push the country forward in the community of nation. And I'm talking about distinguished Dr. Otto Lorin Adeniji Belo. The doctor is a medical practitioner by training, but is a philosopher by orientation, and he is a prolific writer by vision. He has written so much thesis, so much book. He has written books like Lesson of History, part one, and this is one of the books now, Lesson of History, part two, for the Nigerian Republic, and other word essays which was released in 2001, and a new edition was released again in 2022. And uh, I hope you've heard about his profile in the short voice over. So we are going to be talking to Baba today, and uh, you're going to hear a lot from him. Uh, it's a very wonderful, blessed day this Tuesday afternoon in Nigeria. Daddy, I want to thank you for your time, sir. Thank you. you. Thank you so much for I, having me. I want thank to you. say happy birthday. Because, okay. uh, thank you so much. You know, I'm so, I'm so, today when we ran into you, we saw you, you are so fit, you are so, you move fine, you and your beautiful wife. <laughs> thank you. And I want to ask thank you, you that, so how much. does it feel being 80, sir? Ah, oh, yeah, well, they, you know what they say? Yes, sir. Uh, when, you, when you're feeling good, mm. it, you, somebody is behind you. Hmm. When you're feeling good? Yeah, you, somebody is behind you. It, you, you have your God. You have your almighty God's mercy, and then you have your wife, your partner, yeah. who has always uh, had your, your interest at heart, even when you don't want to do it, <laughs> but she's always there. Yeah. <laughs> she, she, she's there like the, like the, like the sugar in your tea. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. Or the honey in your ugi. Uh, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. The, the, the birthday was a shocking one. So how did it cut you? Why were you cut on away? Because... When the cameras came on you, you were shocked. They led you into the celebration. So yeah, you prepared yeah, though? Yeah, you see, oh, she knows me. Hmm. If she had asked me, I would have said no, you, too much. You have been economic. No, no, too, too, much, too, too, much, too, too much into it. And um, I, am always, I, can go, I can do it for somebody else. Hmm. But maybe there's something in me that will not want to take a no for an answer. Hmm. And I don't want to force people to want to do something for to me. To be committed to do for something, to do for, something you for, for me. For you. Because if it's, if it's not out of their way, if they cannot go out of their way for long trade, mm. I don't want it. You know? But my wife knew I would not succumb to it. So she knew how, how she put it together, but it's not, a, it's, it's not a surprise for me <laughs> because she's always doing things for others. Okay, but she, she completely disoriented me. <laughs> I was facing a, I was facing the north while she's doing it in the south. <laughs> That's a pragmatic woman. <laughs> and this is a culture enthusiast. Maybe she understands the details in the culture. Yeah, she, 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 she certainly does. She certainly does. So it shocked you when you ran into it. You were just shocked. That I was just I was thinking I was going to somebody else's <laughs> ceremony. 
<laughs> but it was it was mine. <laughs> In fact, it's, 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 a, it's a very wonderful. Uh, a wonderful, you know, it's a wonderful thing in life to have a good wife. Yes. And uh, that's what I saw in Madame too when I ran into her today. She's looking so beautiful. I don't know her age, but I know you are 80. But I know she's in <laughs> but, my 70s. Yeah, she, yeah, tell God she's my junior. <laughs> <laughs> but you're looking so wonderful. I think it has also rubbed on you because oh, of your... Yeah, yeah this way. Your adrenaline. lean. I, I feel young too. Hmm. <laughs> so before we go back to lifestyle, let's quickly go into history because I've read your book and uh, I keep... Re, let me say reviewing and reread and all that and I saw that you have a whole lot of uh, intellectual strength in terms of deep knowledge of history and I was wondering how did a medical doctor I mean a, a trained medical doctor and a natural health specialist have the uh, I mean uh, the, 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 the passion to write and to concretize history and to even read the deepest aspect of history I mean the history of the evolution of Nigeria in the 60s down to this time. So where did you get that knowledge, that grit, that intellectual grit to write a book, being a doctor, sir? Oh, thank you so much for that question. Mm. Uh, I, I actually, I was a witness mm. as, a, as a young uh, individual in, uh, in, the, in the 40s. Mm. My father, Especially, I have to give this to my, my father and my grandfather. Hmm. My, my father was a business businessman. In those a, days? In those days, a builder of a, a contractor and a builders. But my grandfather hmm. was the, uh, I w the person I would say was the political person. Hmm. I, was, uh, I was a useful youngster, grandson. <laughs> Because whenever she, he called, I was there. Run around. Uh, I had, a, I had a, a senior brother who passed away, uh, who became a victim of malaria, hmm. you know, oh. in his early, t uh, yeah. early teens years. Yeah. And he, but I emulated him. Yeah. Both of us were always at the beck and call of our grandfather. I think he influenced you. Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah, so we were always there. Hmm. So I, uh, I, I was privileged. Uh, to meet uh, the, uh, the, the big guys of the period, the mustache, mustache old man of uh, called uh, Mubolaji Herbert Macaulay. Macaulay, yes, the, the ten-era man. Uh, uh, yeah, the man in our uh, ten-era man. Macaulay. <laughs> and uh, Papa Adema Alakija. You know, they were, they were all returnees, but uh, Papa Adema Alakija changes uh, to his, back to his uh, family name. Hmm. Uh, so, but they were always coming to see my my grandfather, hmm. and I was, you know, I was a little boy, but I was always looking at the old man like, who is this? Who is this man? Hmm. That they, they all come to see him, to seek him for knowledge, for knowledge, or what, is it, what is going on? <laughs> and I said, okay, well, I didn't know. There was nothing I knew at the time, but I knew the events hmm. that was happening. Around you, I, and I, and I knew sometimes when uh, when uh, Papa Mubolaji uh, uh, about Macaulay passed away, okay, hmm. and then uh, uh, Papa Adiyam Alakija was also aged in, uh, as a young boy. That was my view, and then they they brought in uh, Doctor Namdi Azikiwe. Wow, at the time hmm. was the assist was introducing. Him to my grandfather as the next incoming uh, secretary, hmm. secretary of, of, for of the, the of the party of the Democratic Party. party then. You know, at, at that time, hmm. and I saw uh, Doctor Nam Dazikwe prostrated before my my grandfather, and uh, he was able to speak Yoruba. Was fluent. I was I was sitting by the, my Same father. Nam Dazikwe, Nam Igbo man, Igbo, yes, the, of Africa. Yes, hmm. but we never knew him to be an Igbo man. We knew him to be a Yoruba. So he speaks Yoruba. He speak. He was speaking this Yoruba. The first time I'm hearing that, yeah. sir. Because my grandfather was able to speak Hausa and Yoruba. <laughs> Namdi Azikiwe was able to speak Hausa and Yoruba. <laughs> so and he was. He was. Uh, Those are the old original Nigerians. Nigerians. <laughs> they, they were. He was quickly accepted. And I said, my grandfather, I remember, was praying for him that you carry the mantle of the party for a long time. And it was, my grandfather was saying that we have to get rid of this uh, white uh, 
foreigners, no, colonialists. In, colonialists. And that was all I knew at that time. Mm. And then, uh, mm. and I knew the time when uh, uh, Chief Bode Thomas. Oh, the, the, okay, the, he was he was my father's the, lawyer. The stylish Chief yeah. Bode Thomas. He was my father's lawyer. Um, he brought in a chief of Bafemi Awolo, same to the old, same old man, my father, hmm. my grandfather. I can imagine. You know, introducing him to, to him and what happened. Hmm. And that was how I get to know them one by one, one by one, and everything was going on that way. Uh, but I was just always looking mystified hmm. how this thing was going on. And I saw the uh, Rockus in Lagos hmm. in, 19, in 1951. Hmm. Uh, with uh, Oba Adeniji Adele. Oh, yes, that's yeah. interesting. Uh, uh, and the, yeah, yeah. yeah, and uh, Oba, uh, Prince Oyekon. Uh, uh, Ade Inka Oyekon. Ade yeah. yeah. And I saw how uh, Ade Inka Oyekon was installed and then driven out of the uh, palace at, the, at the Gaidu Goro and then ended up in my, fa my grandfather's house. <laughs> And then, <laughs> and then later on, my grandfather summoned the new, the newly installed Oba uh, uh, of Lagos, Musa hmm. Ndiku, uh, Adeni Jadile, you know, back to, to his place. And they came in at, in the dead of night. For reconciliation. And then my the father. dead of the night. The dead of the night. That's backdoor diplomacy. No, yeah, no, the dead of the night. And then I was awoken by my, father, my grandfather. I said, get the water ready. And I got water ready. And I said, okay. And then uh, I remember my, my grandfather saying that uh, uh, Prince uh, Adeyinka Oyekon mm. should get up and pay homage to Prince Adeniji Adele <laughs> and say that uh, Kabesi and then, and, uh, and then, uh, and, and, and then uh, and, uh, may, your reign, may you reign for a, for a long time. Okay. And my, father, my grandfather said, accept your brother. To oh, so Adeni Jadele, mm. either to uh, uh, Adeni Jadele to accept up his it's brother, Adeni Kau Yeko, and they embraced. And I'm looking, because I was there, I witnessed the time with the uh, hooligans who came in and forced Adeni Ade, Ade, Ade Jadele into the palace. Mm. I was at it, Igadu Goro, with, with a lot of a lot of pumps, okay. a lot of pumps, a lot of uh, drums, and every all the hooligans. Came in and I did. I didn't you can to escape through the back door uh, to uh, uh, through Dumagbo to Isale uh, Gogo to, to meet my grandfather. Mm. And I said, "Okay, mm. what the hell? What is this going on?" I, it, I was just. It was exciting for me as a, as a young <laughs> as a youngster. But You're I looking was, at the drama. Never, yeah, and I, I, I and I had to slip back <laughs> into the house. <laughs> At okay. the time, because I was a young boy, yes, sir. My my father must not know that I had escaped to the Gaduga. <laughs> <laughs> and that day of night, that is your mother. You know, my mother, my mother had gone to Ibadan, hmm. so with my okay. with, with my sister. Can you imagine? You know, to, to for, for for nothing. So I was, my mom was not able to see that I had escaped to that kind of area. So. I came back the, home. The, the, the police came back Yes, home. I came back home and I mm. saw that. And then I was surprised. How could they? Mm. This old man, that's my grandfather, mm. did not leave his stool. How could he summon the newly installed Adeniji Adele to his house at that dead of night? Jesus Christ! They don't have the clarion <laughs> to be to be going from my house to that. So I, I let that go. And it was. It took a while, mm. a whole while, and I witnessed the uh, first election of the uh, uh, Lagos City Council. Okay. With uh, mm. Adiemi Lawson. Mm. In those uh, days, uh, who became the chairman of the uh, uh, of the Lagos City Council. Mm. You know, uh, for nine years he was there, 1951 to 60. You know, and then uh, taken over by Adaudu. Mm. I, 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 after that, hmm. so I was able to witness the election and the way the thumb printing and okay. the uh, rigging, hmm. <laughs> over voting at the time so for the action group. <laughs> so this thing started a long time ago. It, exactly, this is exactly <laughs> where the lessons of history had to come in. Oh. That this is not new. 
you know, and then how much you, you will get, the more you go, even I was, I was turn printed, I was now about nine or ten years old, you're, you're was, I, was, I was turn printed three times, and I, each time you go, you get about five shillings or ten and six. <laughs> As a contractor, yeah, but, but, the, contractor. but for a young boy, it, it was exciting. <laughs> <laughs> so, so these things were going on. Oh my God! And and this is how I came to, to get into the. And I'm recording the whole situation mm. as it was going. I was on it was unfolding. Unfolding before you, yeah. live and direct. Yes, and I was uh, still going to my school, trying out. Uh, they said I was a very good student because I was always called as first in the class. And but I. You know, the first thing to class, I thought it was from running. I never <laughs> associated with academics. You thought it was from running on the <laughs> race on the <laughs> But I was already attending to my own, my school work and things like that. And that was how I was. <laughs> I want to ask you that, who was this your grandfather? This mystery man that everybody come to kowtow to, everybody try to give high level regard. Who was he in the society at that time, sir? My, my grandfather was the... Uh, Son of uh, well, his, his name was Mama Losho Abdullah Hiraji. Hmm. Uh, he was the he was the son of uh, Mustafa Abdullah Hiraji, who was the brother. One of the progenitors. Progenitor. He was the brother of Muhammadu Lamrud. Lamrud. Who was the father of Adua, Adua. who became Odua. Odua. Hmm. Or Dudua, hmm. you know, and then they are the brothers. They are the brothers to uh, Osman and Fodio and Abdullah Gogobiri of the uh, Borno in the area. Hmm. And they were princes from uh, South South Egypt, from Southern from Egypt. Egypt, and they were the nu uh, Nubians. 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 Nu they were the Nubians, hmm. and they came with Entora to Songhai. The Sh old Shanghai Empire. Yeah, yeah, before it, it, it metamorphosed into Nigeria and then was broken into with Niger and the rest of it. And that was how we came, we came down. The Osman Danfodio stayed in the northwest uh, of Nigeria. Yeah. Uh, Abdullah Igogobiri moved to the northeast. And Muhammad Limroyd came to Yoruba. Mm. Which is Yoruba land? Yes, sir. You know, and my 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 great my great grandfather was the uh, the uh, fourth brother, who was uh, Mustafa Abdullahi Raji, and his son was my own grandfather. Mm. Mm. <laughs> That's a very strong historical. And then and then it, it was it was they were later to come into to uh, to Yoruba with the jihad, and well, they, they brought the jihad to Yoruba land uh, through. With the with the forces of uh, Igala and yeah. Tapa. Oh yeah, the Tapa from Niger State. The, the, the Niger, Niger State, Niger and State. they came all the way to Lagos up to also. I, th I think they started from somewhere in the world. No, they started from. They, they they consolidated in uh, Efwalaye. Okay, sir. Mm. Efwalaye. Then that was my my grandfather telling me or how they came in. Mm. He was the general. Mm. You know. but this, this is a strong heritage. Uh, yes, so, so they came in, and then it was the general. My grandmother, my, my grandmother on my father's side was the princess of Bida. Oh. In, uh, in, uh, hmm. So, in, and that. In Mina. Yeah, in Mina. Uh, Salamoto. So they came down, and that was how they established themselves in Lagos, hmm. and uh, every, everything became history. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> but I was always wondering, every Friday, Hmm. Because I was born and brought up in Lagos. <laughs> yes, sir. Hmm. You are you are you are one of his uh, uh, his children or his grandchildren. Great grandchildren that, that, came, that was discovered in Lagos here. In Lagos, yeah, hmm. yes. And then I, I said, what, what is it? Well, what, who are these people? How come every Friday they come in the horseback, hmm. riding in front of a house, or every Friday, and then the uh, the Igunu, Igunu from the uh, Tapa yes. area. Uh, the, 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 the Galede and the rest of the traditional, <laughs> the, 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 the epitaphs of the, the traditional the, 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 Because of the, the, my, the, 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 my, my, grand, my grandmother's lineage, mm. they were always coming in, and then I to was pay pushing. homage. To yes, the yes. So I had to. I asked my my grandfather and my father, how did we get here? Who are we? Mm. 
They said, then they told me, you are the only one with the ears. <laughs> mm. You are the only one with the ears. Mm. <laughs> and that was how I was able to piece all of them together in my mind and everything. I'm saying, okay, every, all the houses who came to Lagos, whoever came to Lagos were always coming to pay homage to it. So my, 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 grand, my grandfather mm -hmm. and my father by uh, extension. And then it, it, it was a, my, grand, my grandfather was a devout Muslim. Oh, devout Muslim. Even mm -hmm. devout, very devout Muslim. Muslim. Mm -hmm. And he, he was not interested in uh, political, uh, political or, but he was political, okay. my grandfather. But he wasn't wanting somebody to scratch his name and uh, be wherever anybody thought it would be. He was astute military individual and had a very good precision with regard to how he settled situation, how he allowed uh, co cooperation with, uh, with, with among tribes. Hmm. Uh, the, the, and what, what actually in the whole situation was 1953. Yes, sir. After the uh, Chief Anthony and now removed for independence yeah. with the British. With the British. And uh, the, uh, the Sudan of Sokoto, who I later discovered to be a cousin of mine, Mm, it's also uh, a cousin. Yes. Yeah, Sir Dano Amadou Bello. Because he was the grandson of uh, Osman Danfodio. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, the three brothers. The grandson of uh, Osman Danfodio. Dan because his, his father, Muhammadu Bello, hmm. if you remember. Yeah, direct uh, yeah, yeah, descendant. Who, who was uh, in, uh, who was uh, who this? Hall in at the University of Ibadan. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, Muhammadu Be Bello Hall. Hall yes. Mm. So those were how I, and then when Awolo organized uh, the the talks to stone the uh, motorcade, mm. they diverted it, and here who, where did Muhammadu Bello land? He landed in my father's uh, <laughs> sitting room. <laughs> and I'm saying. <laughs> your father, your father is something else. Your grandfather is something else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm saying to myself. <laughs> Wow! Is this? <laughs> who, 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 are they, who are these people? How did they know? And then he paid homage to my grandfather, and it was uh, paid homage to my father. And I'm saying, okay, these well, are the great people. These, are, of these those, are the people of those days. Those days. They, they, and they, then they, that they, was they, what I the whole thing. I realized that we are all part and parcel of each other in Nigeria, the Yoruba, the North. Yeah, uh, yeah. The, all the old ramification came in, and I had to ask for clarification mm. where, where I had doubt, mm. you know, and that was what happened to me. And that's how I came into <laughs> this uh, uh, is, uh, incident of history. <laughs> you know, if I, yeah, not just, it's not just an incident of history, it's a beauty, uh, what can I call it, it's a beautiful line of history. And you are a very fundamental, uh, a genuine, uh, Habinga of the good old times <laughs> that will heal the upcoming new times that we've not seen because we need people like you to connect us with the with, 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 the, with the yesteryears so that we can understand what we need for tomorrow. So I want to ask again that before we go to because I, I, I read the analysis here and I saw that there were four of them who came from uh, Saudi, Saudi Arabia. You know, we had... Uh, uh, from the Egypt Nubian dynasty, yes, yes. we had the with Madame Fodo Abdullahi Gugubel, yeah. then Mohammedu Limroy, who is your father, your own progenitor, your own uh, family, Lamurudu, who is a Yoruba, mm -hmm. then Abdullahi Mustafa Raji, and all of them. But let me ask looking at the crisis of Igai Dugoro, Adili Jandili, and Oyekon, Oba Oyekon, what was the political? turmoil of that era? Was it that there were political forces that were trying to install or uninstall? Because today now we witness some of these things that people are saying that, oh, the traditional rulers of these days are monetized, that the traditional tool itself has been monetized, that it's not Ifa. Because you also analyze the role of traditional belief here, Ifa, mythology, oh, yes. and the Tesbiu and everything. Yes. But what was really happening in your own little understanding then? And who eventually was put on that throne of the above. Because when we grew up, we knew Oyekon. Oyekon just died some, maybe some 20 years. Yes, yes, 40 plus, years. 40 years ago or something. Uh, is it up to 30 years now? What, this yeah, about 40 years. Yes, ago now. Okay, no, no. I think we knew him in the 80s. Adi Oyekon, Oyekon. Yes. He, he enjoyed his reign. He lived almost 40 years. There. So, but what was happening then, and is it 
political forces of Aulawa or Wu was putting Wu on the throne. Now, who eventually left for Wu? Yeah, Aulawa was the one, was the, when he came in, he started the, uh, the coup against the uh, NCNC. Hmm. He, he, he had this... Uh, the National Congress of Nigeria and Cameroon. Cameroon. He had this uh, leadership of the action group. And he was uh, campaigning against uh, Namdi Azikiwe, mm. who was the leader of the NCNC, that is an ego man, and that is the, he's the uh, authentic Yoruba man. <laughs> and, he and everyone who followed uh, Namdi Azikiwe became his uh, own enemy too. <laughs> Uh, and, most, and most of those guys were people who had gone to the United States, who have, uh, uh, about Yekon Yuk, uh, was uh, from a cool boys high school, mm. and uh, every one of them, like Thomas Benson, J.M. Yeah. Yeah. Johnson, uh, then, you know, Gusanya, uh, and a whole lot of them were against our uh, dictatorial rule, mm. because it was, so they saw him as a dictator, and, uh, and it was a, like a, as a cultist hmm. because yeah. he, he actually brought the uh, elements of that uh, cult into yeah, the, uh, the, the into the faith, the, uh, yes, and all the rest. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So when he when they, when he came, he saw I didn't know I didn't know you were going to become the uh, Oba of Lagos. Hmm. He was next in store. Hmm. So he, he moved the force. Uh, our cousin uh, Adeniji Adele was a trader oh. in Kano City. Mm. in the north. Mm. So he found out, and then they brought Adeniji Adele. Actually, Adeniji Adele was like when I had my birthday. <laughs> the day when I had my birthday. <laughs> he, came, they came, he came down, they said, uh, I will all wanted to see him, and things like that. Just he was going to meet him. A in casual Lega. invitation. A, a casual invitation. Mm. But as soon as he landed at the door, the drones were already prepared. <laughs> And everything was already going on. And then I uh, laid cultural bush for him. Yeah, the, the, and no. he, he came down from uh, Ido, Kata Bridge, down to Adele Wale. He lay by Bomoki, Bomoleru, Wale. Everybody, the rent the, came on, our lower was behind him. And they were going the, in the and the political came, forces, yeah, the, the traditional forces. They, they already installed Oyekon. Hmm. But at that emergency time, they started to do the traditional thing, watching the, the foot of uh, Adele. The new. At the, it was Awolowo who engineered the coup, and had, uh, uh, Oyekon had to escape. Hmm. And then Awolowo installed uh, Adeniji Adele, hmm. who was a prince of, hmm. the, of, the, uh, of the palace also. And uh, it was later, they later on fell, fell apart because... Uh, Adele could not work with him. Hmm. There was no reconciliation. No reconciliation. There was no healing. No healing. Adele could not work because he wanted to be dictatorial. And Adele said, no, Oyeko is my, 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 uh, my cousin. We are all, we are all princes. Of oh, our Lord wanted to wanted dictate to the, the tune. Yeah, the tune. Oh. Well, that was how they fell apart. Oh, so that means Adele Adele even fell apart with his political sponsor. Yes, with the political culture at that time. That was how everything happened. Hmm. So, so that was the chemistry of the, uh, the back door diplomacy to your grandfather's yes, alone. My, yes, yeah, exactly. Okay, so, so my grandfather uh, uh, made them embrace each other and told them that this is this rascal. I remember uh, that was this, the word he used for, uh, uh, of our law. This rascal was trying to disrupt the uh, lineage hmm. of Lagos. We would not allow him. Hmm. The rascal, <laughs> God forgive me, the rascal from Ikenia or something from like Ikenia, that. Ikenia, yes. <laughs> yeah. but, he, he, but my father, my grandfather was still saying that he could not ascertain where he came from. Hmm. Because when he came in, and my, my grandfather banned him hmm. not, never to campaign at the Salegongo Square. That's our law. Our law. Ban our law to never to campaign. campaign. And, so, and if he, if he dare him, he would see what happened. And our law <laughs> never did it. Never. He well, knew. He knew the, the lit man. He was a lit man. Very gentle. Very yeah. small. He was of this man's stature. stature. Hmm. <laughs> but he was loaded with yeah, yes, history. Yes. Uh, that was that was how he was. That was how he was. That was how, he was. That was how my grandfather was. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs>
So, so, so in a, in a sense, it was your father that brought in political balance. My and grandfather. Your grandfather. So that means that Adeniji the lady did his own reign. He did the own reign and, before, and before Oyekon, Oyekon came in. Oh. And he, he, he prayed for both of them that Oyekon will be longer and longer oh. after Adeniji I understand now. And, and that was everything was, became quiet. Oyekon was quiet and accepted uh, Adeniji Adele's rule. So it was Oyekon that even first came in before all of us took him they out. Never, they never let him have any... any any one week, they hmm. never allowed him a week hmm. of rain. So there was a political soldier uh, yes, in. Yes, and took him off. And they brought the commercial then, prince from Kano, Adinja Dili, to come in yeah, because yeah. of political interest. Yes, But yes. luckily, your own grandfather was able to, to quench the, uh, the uh, opera. And, and let them understand that you are the same bloodline. Yes. You are princes of the same uh, father line. Yes. So let him just do his tenor, and you can come back, and it will stay long. Absolutely, hmm. absolutely. That's interesting. But but let me ask you that. The first day your father met Aulowo, how when you saw him, when he came to your father's place, how would you assess him and what did your dad told him? Because I'm sure that Aulowo too, in his own little political understanding, will have paid homage to your father. So how did he... No, he never paid homage. So what happened, sir? Aulowo was always arrogant, mm. especially against who he saw as illiterate. Mm. However fundamental they may have been, I've gone to England okay, to study and, and return, and I've been. He was he bought into the English uh, colonialism. Hmm. Albeit he wanted to replace them. Hmm. If you remember some of his book, he said he he uh, he, uh, he dreamt that he would be the prime minister of Nigeria. Hmm. So he has a <laughs> in, dream. The, in the line in the line of, of the, uh, British okay, of the Macegros and all of them. Yes, he absolutely. Take over from them. Absolutely. Hmm. Absolutely. Hmm. It was it was my grandfather who tried to uh, who saw that and he saw him being arrogant. Hmm. He saw him that uh, he, he, he would not listen. He, he was full of himself. Hmm. Unlike Namdi Azike, who was very very humble. Hmm. Uh, those, those were the contrast hmm. they had. But was there any time that your father came one in one, or maybe somebody brought him to your father or? In the course yeah. of political sojourning. Oh yes, before when he came, it was, it was I told you his uh, uh, chief uh, Bode. Okay, Thomas. Bode Thomas. Okay, sir. Hmm. Hmm. They brought him to your dad, to your grandfather. To my mm -hmm. grandfather, mm -hmm. and then uh, and then my grandfather said, "No, you spoke a lot, but I don't. We still don't know where you came from." Okay, he was trying to introduce himself. himself. Talk about himself. About what he wanted about his to do. His political opinion, uh, yeah, yeah. his political orientation. Then so, uh, but he never, I said, who are you? Hmm. How do we know you are not an imposter? Hmm. Uh, you didn't say anything about yourself. Uh, we don't know your parents. We don't know where you came from. And, uh, you just, and then you don't even seem to subscribe to our tradition. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, so and this was how uh, the whole situation. And then the uh, meeting abruptly ended. Just like that? Yeah, my father said, my grandfather said, please, you can go. Hmm. But don't ever come back to Isalegogo to campaign while I'm still alive. Hmm. <laughs> That's a very distinguished warning. Yes. Hmm. That means your, 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 your grandfather was a distinguished political figure because of his... Yeah, of all the of people, his, all the historic people. lineage, his historic yes, heritage. And uh, I'm... I'm I haven't, I haven't been uh, a jihad, been the leader of the jihadists hmm. coming down from the north and how to establish the Yoruba. Don't forget, hmm. after, uh, after his, his uh, uncle, uh, no, after his nephew, oh, yeah. Yeah. his nephew, nephew. that is uh, Yadwa, yeah. Odudua, yes, sir. after his, his, his nephew passed, after Odudua passed, the uh, Odudua was uh, a man of uh, a lot of sagacity, if you will. If you will. Yeah, a very, man of political uh, sagacity. Political uh, eminence and uh, mm. very diverse and very dynamic with uh, the uh, tradition. All this, after, after it, it passed, the uh, and Oyo, yeah, the Oronyo, Oronyo, who was the first son of yeah, Odudua. Yeah, first son, yeah, Odudua in Oyo. Oronyo brought uh, the, the crown. To Oyo from Ileife. Yes, sir. So, 
there are all the all the seven all the seven sons. Yeah, they all right. took into the uh, various traditional areas of the if if Ududwa uh, Shogo, uh, Oya, Obatala, Obatala, Ogun, mm. and every one of those uh, deities became flo were flourishing mm. in the Yoruba land. It was uh, then uh, Mustafa Abdullah Hiraji decided that he's going to avenge that. Because of the of the of the uh, uh, the, the Christian religion, introduced the uh, Islamic religion religion hmm. into the Yoruba land, hmm. reintroduce it, and that was how my 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 grand my great grandfather came in, and then they they came in to force a whole lot with the forces of Igalas and uh, the Tapas, you know. Yes, sir. Later they came in with them, and then they, they, then they become. You either choose the Quran hmm. or sword. You either choose the Quran, Quran or, or the sword. sword. And that was how uh, they became Imale. Imolile. <laughs> so it's by, you either by, by choose. Force. You do, you either, and they, they realized that if you don't do, use force against these uh, uh, <laughs> different deities, you cannot, you cannot make a way. <laughs> And that was the force it on the adherent of the deities. Yeah, it, uh, for instance, in Iwo, yes, sir. it was Ogun. Yeah. Ogun all the way. Ogun in Iwo land. In Iwo land. Hmm. And then they, they, they break it, they broke it, and then the saying and the rest of them, and then they went into all that area. And then when they came in, they reintroduced the, uh, the uh, Islamic uh, uh, people become part of the dynasties of every uh, town you, 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 and villages town. in Yoruba. Hmm. And, and that was how the uh, Ojokpa Shekere, Oma Atiba, you know, your land. Hmm. There is a lineage. Ojokpa Shekere, Oma Atiba. Oma Atiba, hmm. you know, your land. Hmm. Uh, part of them was the last, the last Salafi. Oh, yo. Yes, sir. Uh, Allah, uh, Adi Emi. Adi Emi. Yes. And, uh, one of, and one of the uh, problems of, uh, that actually created the rift between uh, my dad and uh, my granddad and our lover was the uh, displacement uh, of uh, Allah, Afi Oyo, yeah. who was one of his son's son. Oh, <laughs> the one that. I think it was, they say he was sitting, he was at a meeting and our lover came in, was talking to them, maybe. But it almost said, why would you be sitting or something like that? I hope you heard that story that he was sitting, it, it was a traditional meeting, and all of them, I was talking, and but it was not saying that, I can't be sharing your name, it's drone. Then the cabinet was not saying, you know, Bomo. Actually, he came, he did that in Lagos. Okay. But it almost did that in Lagos. Okay. At a meeting of the traditional rulers. But uh, he did that in Lagos, and uh, the Allah of him went back. Reported the case. I remember reported the case to granddad, hmm. and then he went the back. Allah first slighted, slighted, went back to uh, Oyo, and then, but they, but they came to Oyo, uh, and uh, started to talk. Don't you understand that this man that you are you refuse to acknowledge that is trying to talk on behalf of our Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Because, uh, but it because, was because Allah. None of, because none of the Yoruba Obas accepted our law. Hmm. They were skeptical of him. They were skeptical of him. None of them accepted him. Alaki of Egba land, Owa of Ijesha land, you know, and the only one who, has, who seemed to accept him was Onife. Okay, the. Um, uh, Adi 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 Adi, so he was the governor uh, yeah. general there. And, and also, the other person was Owa, you know, of Owa. Okay. Owa of Owa. Owa. You know, Owa. Uh, 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 yeah, but they fell out. Hmm. Eventually. Eventually. Hmm. Uh, so, none of these uh, Obas of Yoruba land accepted them. Hmm. Uh, apart from the uh, maybe in the Jabu land, yes, in his Jabu in Jabu area, it's in our circle, yes. it's not Kakos. So uh, that was what happened at the time. So. Ayi 
loba loba ori ade mo kiyin ku joko e se te wa nbi sugba e je kin fun kankan ibi ti ko na ba wa tabi president ba wa ko si oba na o lati dide fun governor tabi fun president e dide e joko Ejo, ejo, ni le karo jire, nkambeji, lambo wafu, among others. Beish, ojo uri, ati iku. Governor ni iku. Tokyo ti eni okbalo, nga to bashi nishi governor. To ba se ki o ba se governor mo even gba ti mo se president mo ndo ba le fo ba sugbon tin ba wo ya ara oba o do ba le fun mi so e je ki agbe asawa ka gbe laruge When they went up, but they Thomas came back to Oyo and they started to ask uh, of the Allah, of it, yeah. who are you not to accept? This is the new leader of Yoruba. Yoruba to, and Allah of it, said, but they, how you, you are shouting in, uh, in the palace. And you are Balogun Oyo. Okay, he has a traditional yeah, title. The title that oh, they yes, gave from Oyo. Yes, it's from yeah, Oyo. You are from Oyo. Yes, we I, don't. You know, we don't do this. This this man has influenced you wrongly, and then when he kept it on, they are, wait, I'm coming, and then went into the room and came back. Now that you are, you, you already established yourself that you are no longer a, a respecter of the uh, tradition, just the way you are shouting on me, continue to bark mm. as a dog all over throughout your life. And that was how he came back. And then he became the, uh, the talk of the town. <laughs> Today, he's still the talk of the town. <laughs> the talk. So he, he went, he, 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 it's like he sold his reality because of an outsider. Yes. He, he was like, oh, oh, tell you, Kabiesi, Mole. Ben. You know, ben, and yes. uh, Kabiesi became irate. irate with him, and uh, Kabiesi couldn't handle him, you know, because till today, a lot of people say, oh, the story is a figment of imagination and uh, all that and it's not a it's not a figment i will always avenge, avenge him by deposing the allah of your oh yes that was the later that story later, yes. yeah. when he became the interim uh, uh premier of western region 1954. Hmm. he deposed the same man yes he felt slighted that the man made mess of his uh, socialite friend hmm. yes does it mean that there is a consequence for spiritual indiscipline? I mean, if Polytomos can be the Balogu and he, he, he talked down, they said Polytomos was so rich, he was a famous person. He, mean, was the, he, was, he was the very famous Yes, and that he was the one that even brought Aulawa to the social scene in yes, Lagos. Yes, he was the one. Aulawa, nobody knew Aulawa in Lagos. Hmm, nobody was, knew Aulawa in Lagos. So should we now say that he paid wrongly for that association because he felt that Allah should have been revered, that the Allah should revive him. Yes, mm. yes. Mm. Yeah. He, he was he was the one actually yeah he, he, he was the one who took Aulaw around the uh, pe people of importance in Lagos. In Lagos social setting. Mm. Yes. Mm. So I will all have to now pay back by by removing the post, the allowing. Yeah. And mm. one of and one of his way is also that uh, that uh, any enemy like Baba uh, uh, you know by the, slightly deposing him quickly mm. get you, and replacing with his cousin Adele the second Adele hmm. Adele was the first Adele Adele Hmm. Yeah, so the, this Adelie was the second. Yeah, Adelie, was Adelie, Adelie was the second. Hmm. 
In fact, let, before we go back to Shifaulo, I, 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 there are a lot of secrets because all the, the all these details are even in this book, and uh, this book looks so very small but very powerful because it's loaded with historical facts, and a lot of people are there, uh, by the this broker you are going to see a phone number, emails that you can reach out to to get a copy of this book. That is Lessons of History, Part 2 for the Nigerian Republic and other world essays. You're going to see the story of what Baba spoke about now here. Then you're going to also meet the story of Aulawa, the character of Aulawa, the AG, the Christ between Aulawa and Akitola versus Sadana of Sokoto. It's, the, on, it's the, on Amazon. Yeah, it's also on, okay, it's on Amazon too. Amazon. So you can read what brought uh, the, 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 the real infight between Awo because Akitola hosted the, the Saudana in Ibadan when there was the launching of a mosque and how Aulawa decided to put a political event on that same date <laughs> in Jos and how uh, Akitola tried to play in between the two, the two events and eventually how it was disgraced after the political meeting. A whole lot of history. But sir, what really took me on is the issue of the... He said, he said meanwhile, after the demise of Muhammadu Lamroid, which is Lamurudu, yeah. the progenitor of the Yoruba uh, people, his only son, Ya Adua, Odua, or Odudua, perhaps not as able to the clean white sand of the ocean. Okay, he's talking about the. He said, the, uh, uh, he said the practice, he said some people with less knowledge and whose personal frame of references will deny the relationship. The Edu ethnic and the Sekiri evolved from the Yoruba central. The first suburb of Benin City was Ewe Ewe Demi. Ewe Demi, yes. who was one of the sons, third son of the Udua. Yes. The subtitle resulting is now a historical record, especially regarding the Jaws, who are kinsmen of other riverine ethnic extensions. Anyway, what I want to say is that Yadua, that name is very significant. You can imagine that we had a president that was called Yadua. Yes. So I'm, I want to ask, Yadua, you call Odudua. A lot of people will say Odudua is from Saudi Arabia. Uh, the, the lot of uh, tonation, the lot of uh, diction, uh, uh, mal, um, maligning of that name. But here is Yadua. Is there any relationship with this Yadua and Yadua of the North? And who is this Odudua here? I mean, uh, um, Lamroid. Lamrodo. Lamrodo. Lamrodo, as I said before, is one of the brothers, hmm. of one of the four princes. Good luck, let's do it.
as we pray. Eternal King of Glory, we thank you for adding to the day of our Father, Chief Doctor Otto Loring Adeniji Belo. We worship you and give all the glory to you, O Lord. We know that all good and perfect gifts come from you, O God. You are the source of blessing, and we ask that you rain down upon the celebrant. May you, may you continue to shower him with your love and mercy. Amen. Turn your face, O Lord, towards him, Amen. and instill peace Amen. on his heart. Amen. We lift up to you the family of our Father. Chief Doctor Otolori Adeniji Bello. And may your abiding presence will remain in their family. Amen. God the Father, Amen. be the center of their household Amen. and guide them to be better Christians. Amen. Lord, we also leave this gathering up to you. Please keep us away from us. Amen. And may we not experience any problem during the celebration. Amen. Guide each and every one of us, Amen. Lord God, from the host to the technical engineers, so that the program will go smoothly. Amen. Father, may we continue, continually gather for joy, and the celebrant will live in good health Amen. all the day of his life. Amen. We report any arm that shall come near the celebrant Amen. and his family. Amen. We believe that you will always guide and protect him. Amen. We ask that by this time next year, we shall gather again to see Chief Dr. Otoluni Adini Jibelu. Heavy, Amen. stronger, Amen. and fruitful. Amen. We pray in the name of God the Father. Amen. God the Son Amen. and God the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. The last prayer together. Our Father, who art in heaven, I will be in thy name. Thy kingdom come, that will be the mountains, as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, as forgive those trespasses against us. We do not to the temptation. Deliver us from the evil, for thy name is the kingdom. Praise and worship. We rise. Be grateful 
to God, and ya joshuni o holy to lata kilolo ashe kubo kubo bi oloro ba ukoko lo mi koto da isi koto da wasi o e ba ukolo.
forget how kind he is sorry he forgives all my sins and heals all my diseases he keeps me from the grave and blesses me with love and mercy he fills my life with good things so that I stay young and strong like an eagle the Lord judges in favor of the oppressed and gives them their rights. He revealed his plans to Moses and let the people of Israel see his mighty deeds. The Lord is merciful and loving, slow to become angry and full of constant love. He does not keep on rebuking and he is not angry forever. He does not punish us as we deserve or repay us according to our sins and wrongs. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The second Bible reading shall be taken by Master Adekunle Adekunme Elekuru. Verse 25 to 24. So, are we ready, please? Matthew chapter 6, verse 25 to 24. Shall we all rise? Shall we all rise, please? Can we read it together, please? No, no, you are reading it. Read it. Okay. Therefore, I tell you, do not worry about your life what you may eat or drink or about your body. 
what you will wear is not life more than food and the body more than clothes. Look at the birds of the air. They do not sow or reap or store away in bonds. And yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not as much than valuable than they? Can any of you by worrying add a single heart to your life? And why do you worry about clothes? See how the flowers of the field grow? They do not labor or spin. Yes, I tell you that not even Solomon in all his splendor was dressed like one of these. If that's how God clothes the grass of the field, which is here today, and tomorrow is thrown into the fire, will he not much more clothe you, you of little faith? So do not worry, saying, what shall we eat, or what shall we drink, or what shall we wear? For the pagans run after all these things, and your heavenly Father knows that you need them. But seek first his kingdom and his righteousness, and all these things will be given to you as well. Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about itself. Each day has enough trouble of its own. I read, I read the last verse again. Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about itself. Each day has enough trouble of its own. The Lord bless the reading and the fulfillment of his words in Jesus' name. Amen. As we are about to listen to God's words, we will sing the next hymn. Nearer my God to thee, nearer to thee. <laughs> Take us away from you. Nothing. 
even the first scarcity, even the Fulani S-men, the Boko Haram, and all the ugly situation we are experiencing in Nigeria will never and can never take us away from you. Therefore, at this moment, Lord, we pray that you speak to us Amen. so that we be stronger even than before. Amen. That we walk in your way. Amen. That your way will be our will. Amen. And your will will be our will. Amen. As we are celebrating our Father today, Lord, as we listen to you, let the celebration be permanent. Amen. And to the glory of your name. Amen. In the name of God the Father. Amen. The Son. Amen. And the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let's be seated, please, in the presence of God Almighty. Let me first service today. Let me also appreciate our mommy, our prof, who I call this. That by his grace, Daddy will surely be surprised today. And I know you are surprised. I'm still surprised. It's marvelous. Hallelujah. Amen. The surprise package shall be permanent in the name of Jesus. Amen. Because the surprise package, package is the joy of God that is in you. Amen. Amen. Let me also acknowledge the presence of the boys. The old boys association. I don't want to use the old boy. The boys association. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And uh, every one of us here, all well wishes. A presence of joy like this shall be established in our homes Amen. and shall be permanent Amen. in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I am not surprised that we are having a surprise package like this for our father. The first day I knew Baba at uh, Freeman Methodist Cathedral. Abe Okuta and Mama, they came to my office cheerfully. I was just looking, but one thing that is still surprising me today is that the way I saw Baba, the way I knew Baba today, I cannot see any changes at all. Even my minister here was saying, Is it true that this man is 80 years? <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Baba, please, um, let's Baba read just the first two verses of Psalm 103. Psalm 103. Just the first verse, verse 1. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My soul. All my being, praise His holy, holy name. Praise the Lord, my soul. I will not forget how kind. He is. He forgives all my sins. Just verse one. And he is of my sins. Verse two. Now. Praise the Lord, my soul. I do not forget how kind he is. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Yes, let me just remind us why we are here today. You know why we are here. But I just want to remind you before uh, treating that two verses. Why we are here is in verse 3 of Psalm 34. Where the children brought men together and agreed that it is worthy to have this celebration. And they don't want to have it on their own. They don't want to, to they don't want it to be a slim kind of celebration, but at least to embrace some people with them. And that is why we are having this gathering today. That is, they are inviting us. Come, come and rejoice with our family. Come and rejoice with our daddy. For God is good to him. Come, join us. Let's celebrate God together. Let's praise his holy name together. For our God is good. And look at what Baba and Mama is saying today. In that verses. Say, bless the Lord. Oh my soul. 
and all that is within me. Blessed is holy me. Bless the Lord with all my soul and all within me. All within me, all I have. All within me, all within my capacity, within my jurisdiction, within my environment that you have bestowed upon me. Come together, let's arise and praise the Lord. And Mama is also saying that in recognition of what Papa has just confirmed, Mama is now saying, Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and forget not all his benefits. Eh, I know, <clears throat> Papa, if we begin to ask you, how many of you started this journey together as uh, colleagues in the <laughs> primary school, uh, standard, uh, modern school, to secondary school, and even to today, some are no more. In fact, some members of the family are praying that God have mercy upon this man, take him away. And what can you want by do I I have witnessed it. And the fire I saw how my brother in the uh, uh, what color is it? Holding tight Baba here and dancing together. Very agile. It is God doing. Now I said I will ask you a question. Well, I will not ask that question, but I just want to remind you of what you have witnessed. When Baba was leading, what did you observe? He removed his glass. He removed the glass. Do you know, as small as I am, I cannot read without glass. Yes. <laughs> it's a natural gift of God. That is what Mama is reminding us. All God's benefits. Recognize it. Praise Him. Rejoice in Him. What I, the only thing I notice in Baba is the natural gift that is in him. <laughs> Made it known to us that he uh, is old. <laughs> and what is that natural? <laughs> eh? <laughs> the white <white's> green. <laughs> and do you know, I, 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 I told some people somewhere, today, today, we have so many people with green. <laughs> I think we have... Um, let me just mention about five ways by which we can have this, mm -hmm. if not more than that. Like here at the job, in your meji, la saba manli, to mani no fufu. Remember, we need to be like here at the job. I'm talking of uh, uh, late 60s, I can still say of late 60s, 70 to today. To today. Now, I want meji to man saba ali to mani no fufu. Ikini, onya wa agba, bi babayi. Isn't it? Ikeji, ola wa afi, abino. Awomichi yelo mani yelo fufu. But if you observe these days, let me just tell you additional uh, artificial ways. <laughs> now, ni lo awo yelo fufu ta atoni lo de odi. I met a class of awo color riot. <laughs> now, you know, I want to I want to be specific of white green. Now, no, I want to for fun. That to man, I want to to man far. I want my say. Let people know me. Let me be popular. Let me let 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 me be recognized, even when you are nowhere to be found. One of one of she artificial and for fun. Be a bass in solo. Be a kumbo wansa. I want to lose it. No fufu. Now, I want to talk to my wife. No fufu. He share, or she, he ya will be far, far away from us in the name of Jesus. Even though the situation in Nigeria is calling for that, but for God forbid, bad thing in our lives in the name of Jesus. In the name of our poverty. I want to talk to my wife. When you. Make scrambling and partition to be what you what you not ought to be at the moment. Example. Bogba and what you have won't launch she or she are wooing. Ada, ada, ada. 
You just want to become. You just want to become. Ti won ba lo ose. Eyan ma tun fa. Another thing, to tun fa. O ni wipe a wee delay. Ti I inherit from our fathers or mothers side. A wee delay eyan ma no mo kekere ta sese bi. E kan ni pe ero fufu yo lori e naturally. Iyen o fi yan pe agba ni. Another thing, don't don't fire. Be made with this guy, bro. Mary, Mary, Mary. Okay, but we just buy you a cousin. Another, another one. Don't don't man fire. Be energy, be a taba, be a ubobi. Bye bye. Koshe shelo, fuma maluni. Me le so, me le so, beki kani ya wumi o mi beki nubi o. Koshe shelo, fuma maluni. Hello, why are you laughing? Nothing is impossible to for God. Eh? Only war, men no pause, but not men no stop. Praise the Lord. Now, Tima Moba Pimo, Omo Yo, Nepe Hibu, Tolipe, Agba, Alubuara, Lapi Pimo. These are the ways by which you can uh, have this white uh, green. But the one that is natural, the one that we show people respect, is the one Papa is having here today. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. There, are, there are a lot of things that Papa begin to talk and tell you. There are a lot of law of diminishing return that is affecting him as he is here. I want to tell you that you are 60. At the moment of diminishing return, out of, out of mass of mass of pay, and total of one eighty. I don't know how many elder generations we have here. I don't know how many do we have. I know of Baba. Any other person? Total of one eighty, maybe. Any other person? We see. Ah, Baba. That is between uh, 89 to 99. Then you get to 100, and that is centurion. Then after that, after 100, you get to super, no, it's super, super centurion. <laughs> Papa is going there. Amen. God bless you, my sister, for saying amen. You will get there amen. with the longevity of life. Amen. Good health and sound mind. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Now, in the name of God, let me just remind those those that are not up to my age. Let me remind you. I, I want you to hear me, Baba. You will agree with me on this. What's something that is really affecting me as I am here? With age. You know, I said it somewhere. Sometimes I was looking for my glasses. I was going for a service elsewhere. I was looking for a particular reading glass. I wanted to use it too much. I was just searching, 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 and others were waiting for me outside. Okay, dear law, oh, dirty law. When I couldn't locate or find it, I just decided, let me go with another one. I picked another one. As I was about putting it on my feet, I, I discovered that the one I was looking for, I put it on my <laughs> yeah. I don't know whether you noticed that Mama, you will agree with me. This is what I want to say now. Sometimes you will put something on, on your hand. Yeah, you oh, let me go there and bring it in the, in the house. Before you get to the living room, you forget. Agba no jebe. Agba ti gye. Baba, you are looking younger, looking younger. Yes, it's true. We are praising God and the people surrounding him. Because beside or behind at the front or back of any successful man, there must be 
woman. A not a not a not a woman. A wonderful woman. A successful woman. Not just a woman. A successful person. People listen. So, only you do that. That only it. It was it. That's it. That's it. Only you believe. To 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 be. You know what I'm saying? Cafe Nifo. Mama. I salute. Kudos to you. You are a wonderful woman. Ti baba ti mama ba wa si office wa tan be se relate mama wo pe apo la won won yo se ba se ngba to wa ni we This is man of us and a wife cat and rat at home but togetherness in unity we stand when they get out We are us on to ti da ju ni pe je ka ma fi exhibit to your parents and your children let them know that in unity you are standing. I don't know how many of us here can boldly stand up before their children and say, Daddy and Mommy, they are together. Inwardly, outwardly. I don't know how many of us here can say that. And this is adding joy to our lifespan. I want to bring you all to the team of my back for where I'm going to go. My stroke. Tabi Baba, they tell Papa, no for me, me Mama. That is why Mugbadu of Mugbadu, they tell him, I want more water, 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 Ara we re 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 o at eighty. Ara we re 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 o. But because the children they believe that Baba deserve more than this. Wo wo wa ju wo we ni, and they recapitulate of all 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 the suffering Papa and Mama made because of them. And today they are all successful. They will never come down. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. So, Baba, okay, I had, I had some people when you were coming as part of the surprise package. They were singing um, birthday crosses. Yes. And I was telling my people here, you know, I, I was asking them, do you know why people are no longer saying, "Ure, ure, ure, ure"? It's not coming again. This is the social party that you can be hearing people say hooray. Mm -hmm. uh, he, 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 he. This is instead of hip hip, they will say praise God, praise God. I ask an elderly person sometimes. Can you father be man who has a story? Hip 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 hooray. It's the, 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 the natural meaning or interpretation is lift, lift, lift. But we we'll later change it to. He, he, he. One day I went to Hawaii, Yoruba, Hawaii, and I go to do. So I go to you. So I'm not going to wash his hair. Hello. Am I speaking to somebody? Yes. Mister, tell me, me or my boy, I should have kissed you. I'm going to deal now, now, can't go. And we have some. We have some saw in those days. I want. I want something, something like on like this is, and they can't follow, and they can't pass on it. I want, I want you to do you want to So that was what I want to be. I know you are a and they can't walk. I want to walk. I want to walk. Lift, lift, lift. So I pray. I want to be like. So I want to walk. I see no way. Praise the Lord. What are we saying? Yes, you remember, and you know how many years did Jesus Christ spend before departing from this simple world? Who can tell me? 33 years. 33 years. 33 years, three months. Now, and today, everybody is calling him Father. Why? Can anybody answer that? Why do we recognize Jesus as Father? Mommy. Mommy. Oh, yeah, answer that. <laughs> Huh? What I said. I didn't hear what you said. 
because you didn't listen. Yes. yes. Who can tell me why why we are still recognizing Jesus Christ as Father, even at somebody who died at 35 at 33? Hello, the Jacqui and the Guam will live out. Yes, I mean, I mean, that's still you who has a pretty baba. Why? Can anybody tell me? I don't want to cross answer. I don't want to cross answer. I don't want to cross answer. No, you record, you signify. That is the life. Yes. Who want to tell me? Yes, my daddy. Before Abraham was, Jesus he was. He is. He is. He is. Yeah. God bless you. That is one. Yes. Yes, I you are Yes, my daddy. Mama, mama. Born with the father. He is born with the father. One with the father. Yes. Any other? Any other? Yes, ma. It's a maker. <coughs> our, our maker. Yes, theological. Yes. Yes. Okay. Because he was submissive, even to the father. To death. And that is why up to today we are saying our father. And you will never hear anybody say uh oh Jesus. Anybody to Babu I have a late see. Me only can be late to see Jesus. Papa continue to be in Christ. How could it hear you? She might be going to the way Jesus does or on a ye, they have a bed. I've heard little about you. Said Daddy, Nile Jebuna Catole, I mean, Nieba, Catole, Fin, your joy, Tiba by Jay. One way, what? One way, she. Lonely a month away. You are Tijewa. Eja bi bo lo aga aye le o iwa ti se wa eja bi bo lo aga oju lo wa o fefe iwa ti se wa eja bi bo lo aga ejo e e wo enikan legbe yin e ba mi wa sube yen fun a ko lori o ya o iwa ti se re iwa bi bo lo aga aye le o he was his share, and what he go to a gauju or a warfare. He was his share, and what he go. Now, what you say? So, hello, me, hello, me. Be a new way, what will be a calling? What come? Oh, yeah. He was his share, and what he go to a gauju. He was his share. I think all we go, Luaga, O Juan, Luan, O Fe. He was a shame. He was a shame. He was a shame. He was a shame. Ba se ni lati ma toju ara wa lai furu emi ara wa ati ka ninu bibili lesin yi ene we ma ti ori kefa o so fun awon biri sin question for ta ni ninu ni ni pa niyan sise to le bi gbo wo kokun oju aye re just a cubit to his life and nobody can do that Olorun agbaye o Ampa baba ya yo loni ye ka yo ba wa ya yo O ti le je pe ki se bi ati pe to laye lo se pataki But how well we live our life Father we ask in your love Let it be well with us Amen Grant us peace Amen Ebo with the crisis in this nation, Nigeria, 
grant us peace. Amen. Prove your sufficiency. Amen. Let your prudential mercy speak for us. Amen. And your grace shall abound. Amen. In the name of God the Father. Amen. God the Son. Amen. And God the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Amen.
Feshi Fere. Mufeshi Fere.